setups if you got the rotation and breaking stress if you don't yeah exactly but also again you might not be in the exact scenario to have the specific setup that you're talking about and sometimes setups if you have them aren't always going to work based on what's you know actually being that you still have to win the gunfight first off but second off you're not always going to be in the scenario where it's i almost took the regular fucking pen I meant to use the other pen. You're not always going to be in the situation where it's like, guys, everyone's off, off, of, off a new. We're all rotated. You go here, you go here, you go here, and you go here. You, you, like there's sometimes that it happens, but a lot of times the situation might be fucked, and you have to adjust based on that. And you still have to read the pressure. Like this team that's breaking can go here. They can go mid. They can go around. You know what I'm saying? So you still have to adjust your setup based on that. And sometimes, let's say this is player one, this is player two, this is player three, this is player four. Player four is not always going to be the, in the player four area, if that makes sense. Player four is not always going to be player four in this scenario. That's a, this is a big thing that people don't realize. Player four here might spawn up and he has to be player one in this situation. So he's not playing in the exact same scenario that he's playing every single time. Player two could be in player three's situation. You spawn up in a match, you're player one, you have to be ready to do player four's job in this specific scenario. You know what I'm saying? So that's the thing with, with default setups. Everyone has to know every single thing if you're going to fall into that default setup. And most of the time, you're not going to be in that default setup. Most of the time, you're going to have to adapt to the, on the fly because some guy's going to get a kill over here. You're going to spawn out. They might have three guys on here. They have one guy left on old. Situations are fucked. You have to be on your, on your, on your feet on the fly. But just to say that like, oh, we can fall back into our setup. It's a lot more complicated than it seems. Yeah, and that's also accounting for you're going to read the pressure correctly and focus on the gunfights in the exact order that they need to be focused on. Because what if you're in the you're in your setup here, and they do two two, and so now you, they have two guys here, right? So you think the break's coming in through here, so these guys focus on these two guys here. Actually, they also have two guys here, and now you're you, like if this one guy dies, this guy has might adjust. Or if these two guys get kills here, this guy just here, they break on in through here for free. There, there's a lot of things that go on into it. So you have to be adapting regardless. Very hard to prep for something like that, if that makes sense. Communication is a key. Exactly. Two biggest things. Info and communication. That's respawn for you right there. Info and communication. You can even say the same for search, honestly. If I was a player, I would get deja vu so often. Yeah, I mean, you're going to get in a lot of similar scenarios. Maybe not, like, not the exact same where all eight players are in the same spot or all four players or your players are in the same spot, but you're going to get in the same situations. Don't get me wrong. Like off Karachi, let's say Karachi P2 to P3, right? Think about it this way. We probably come off of old Karachi P2 and had to break P3 in scrims. Like, you can go any of these certain ways, but we've had so much practice going through all these ways. We've probably gone, you know, let's say this way fucking 100 times in our in our career. Or we've gone this way 50 times. But, you know, there is going to be... You're going to be getting in those situations a lot, but you're not going to be in this exact same situation, if that makes sense.